Hi friends, welcome to TechMates. Uh, today we are going to look at uh, another hacker rank problem, and it's a, it is uh, named as strings making anagrams. Okay, and the difficulty is easy. Max score is twenty five. Okay, and this is the problem, guys. Okay, so let's see what is. Alice is taking a cryptography class and finding anagrams to be very useful. We consider two strings to be anagrams of each other if the first letters can be rearranged to form the second string. In other words, in other words, both strings must contain exact letters in exact same frequency. For example, B A C D C and D C B A C are anagrams, but B A C D C and D C B A D are not. Alice decides on an encryption scheme involving two large strings where encryption is dependent on the minimum number of character deletions required to make the two string anagrams. Can you help her find this number? Given two strings A and B that may or may not be of same length, determine the minimum number of character deletions required to make A and B anagrams. Any characters can be deleted from either of the strings. For example, if A equal to C D E and B equal to D C F, we can delete E from string A and F from B so that both remaining strings are C D and D C which are anagrams. Okay guys, so actually this is uh, quite simple. Uh, what we have to do is, uh, okay, let's see the sample input. Okay, if we can call a string anagram, two strings as anagrams, if the characters in that string, the frequency of the characters in that string, both of them should match. Okay, let's say C D. Okay, so this is not an anagram first of all because C C C is there here in the first string. And in the second string also C is there one time, okay. But D is not there and E is not there. And A is not there, B is not there. So, in this case, these are not anagrams. But our problem is, how many uh, characters we have to remove from both, so that both will become anagram, okay. So, in this case, if I remove D, E and A, B, both strings will have C C with one frequency, one frequency of C in first string and one frequency of C in second screen, st uh, string. So in this, uh, so like that we need to count how many deletions of such characters are required to make both of the strings as anagrams. Okay. So there is also explanation here if you can check. And uh, so let's code guys. So the basic idea of this and any anagram problem is we have to find the frequency in both strings. Then store it in an array. And then uh, what you have to do is since the frequencies are there, you have to loop through that. And then you have to find out uh, the difference. And that will give you how many how many uh, number of times we have to delete a particular character okay so let's code guys okay so first of all um, I'm gonna take int deletions is equal to zero so this is this will hold our deletions okay then we need a um, int array for the frequency a is equal to new int array of 26 26 because there are 26 characters and similarly I have to copy this for b and it will also have 26 now we have to loop through both actually for int i equal to int i equal to 0 i less than uh, a dot length and i plus plus so loop through this uh, okay. loop through this and frequency a 
of uh, what we have to give is uh, care at a dot care at the index i right so care at i minus a because this is small a right so this will actually give me an index okay so i am doing a plus plus this and similarly i uh, need so this is going to store the frequency for a similarly i need to do it for string b and b here and i need to store it in b okay now this frequency array we have uh, i have the frequency for a and b so now I have to loop through, loop through, so loop through i equal to, and i equal to uh, 0, i less than 26, which is the number of characters, and i plus plus, and we need deletions. So this deletions we are going to get now deletions equal to deletions let's make it plus equal to uh, so what we have to do map dot absolute of so I am going to compare each character now based on the index so frequency of AI minus frequency of frequency B of I. So this will give me the count. And at last we have to return this. Okay. I'll run this form. Compilation error because minus okay okay this should be a character not a string so this should be a single quote okay okay hopefully this will work and file is done and these are the test cases guys yeah perfect so my all test cases are passed uh, under 25 points so basically what i tried to do here is so for okay let's say there are two strings okay so for each string i am looping through the string and for each character i am getting an integer value the equivalent integer value which will form the index of this array okay so in that index I am incrementing the value ok so the index for a particular character would be same for both because this minus a uh, means uh, this minus a means you will get 0 so a let's say if it is a ok let's say this a character is a minus a we are going to get 0 okay and if it is b minus a then we are going to get one so for each character in in the string a and for each character in string b i will be able to get an index and i am incrementing that index value in the each of the arrays okay now what i am doing is i am looping through all the uh, i am looping through all the indexes and i am doing the I am doing a minus because if C has three frequency in A and B has only one, so I need to delete two from A, right? So two minus one, uh, sorry, three minus one, that is two. So I need to delete two times. So for each index, uh, I am storing uh, the character 
and I'm doing a minus the frequency minus of that and I'm doing an absolute I don't want negative numbers so I'm doing an absolute and returning this hopefully uh, you got to know uh, how to work with anagrams uh, if you like the video please like it and do subscribe also